I think everything is working now. I ate some some breakfast, lunch, pizza, so I think that uh I think I'm ready to to do my little internet show now. So let's do the internet show now. It's me. Oh, oh yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Hello. 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 Is anyone there? Hello. Oh. I guess no one's here. Well, I just started the show anyway. People will be here. I'm sure. I'm here. And that's all that matters. So, it's not all that matters. That's... That's selfish of me to say. But, um... I'm gonna... I'm gonna play a a video game. Oh lord, I ate some pizza. Like some breakfast, pizza, lunch, pizza. And I was like hoping I would have more energy. And I feel like I have like a certain type of energy that is more, but then like I feel like now I also have less energy in other areas. So, I don't know. But what I do know is I'm going to play a game. Kind of get rewarmed up. And that game is called Dino Wars Destruction of Spondylus. I, I'm actually playing this game 100% blind. I just I picked it because it had a really cool sounding name, and I like cool stuff. So hopefully it lives up to its uh, cool sounding name, and hopefully it's uh, really cool because. I will be disappointed slightly. Well, that's uh, it's not too bad so far. It's uh, it looks like it has like robot dinosaurs, which are, you know, obviously cool. So. And it splits password up into two words, which is like unique. You know, most people would um, use the standard password as one word in itself. So, like, this game is already, you know, destroying norms. I'm all about it. All right, well, let's press start and do some Dino Wars. Oh, so you don't play as a dinosaur? You're like a, a weird Power Ranger looking dude? That's a little bit disappointing. He does have higher than average jumping abilities. And I do like that there's no time limit so I can sit here and talk about it. Do I have a limited amount of ammo? It 
does not look like my ammo is limited. Cool. Alright, so we're gonna do some platforming, I guess. I have a feeling that's not gonna be a very fun part of this game. Alright, well I jumped to that lift. Ouch. That's not a very good start. getting challenging up in here. Oh, I got him in one shot. It seems that walking over the spikes does not have a, a whole lot of repercussions. Oh good, an energy thing. I'm just gonna walk over that and give me full energy almost. Whoa, do I get to ride inside of a giant dinosaur? Is this where the game gets all badass? Yes! Yes! Alright. Okay, I think it's getting awesome now. He can't shoot, but he can punch you with his robot dinosaur arms. I like this. This is cool. Oh, you stupid stegosaurus ass. Like, I feel like my favorite dinosaur is the stegosaurus. But I can't remember if that's one of the ones that, like, they've said as a fucking shit asshole. I don't know. I might be changing my mind about the Stegosaurus. jumped in the hole that time. I hope you get infinite continues. Gotcha. Ooh, it's a triceratops. He's a little bit harder. Ooh, now I got shooting power?
That's awesome. downgrade to that one. Holy hell. Oh good. This game is very generous with its con continues. It looks like the enemies can hurt each other. This game is so fair. I feel like I like this game. And that dinosaur looks like he's afraid of me. That blue thing on the ground is like a mine. Fuck. It's a pterodactyl. Yeah, robot dinosaurs are right up my alley. I think that weapon might suck. I'm not gonna get it. Back here, you've got a weapon I want. Scaredy cat. This time. Yep.
And I didn't hit the mine. Cool. That's a damn pterodactyl. At least it gives me energy. That's a new uh, weapon. Uh, seems like it would require a lot of accuracy to use. It's like a Three Stooges haircut. It's weird. I guess there's no way to change my weapon. You can pause the game. Dinosaur time over? It is. Alright, I guess I'll be the blue dude for a minute. Looks like a scary hole that I don't want to fall into, so... Cool. It left me some energy.
Alright, so you only have one life. That's not cool. Like the screen flickering gets so bad that he disappears sometimes, and that's not very helpful. See, like he disappeared. And that's not very useful when you're trying to do platforming with slightly stiff controls. He disappears. Not fair. This game is starting to make me mad a little bit. Looks like when he gets hit, he goes into like invincibility mode for when he like get hit. Son of a bitch! have to jump across this crap. Alright. You can do it, Alex. Thanks, Leonard. Really need all the encouragement I can get. Alright. I'm gonna do it. Wait, can I just jump up here? Afraid. Oh. Is that a Metroid? Is that Mother Brain? What is Mother Brain doing in this? Why would I jump on that moving platform when I can just jump up here? Um, 
I did it. Backwards. I'm afraid to jump on that platform. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. That's gonna make me go all the way back. Fine. I can do it. At least nobody respawned. This game is generous in a lot of ways. Alright. Oh, do I get to be the dinosaur again? I like that part. Okay, I never want the tiny little bullet things. Ever. the bombs. They're the worst. I am. I'm playing a robot dinosaur game. I hope you're not. I hope that you don't hate robot dinosaur games as much as you hate Mario games. Then we might have issues. I've never played this game before. I took a chance. And uh I know, I'm just picking at you. I know you don't hate Mario. I'm exaggerating. And there is a big difference between hate and not liking, so. You can be a little, you know, a little too Mario sometimes. But you can't lose with robot dinosaur games. I'm 
this game gives you infinite continues so you can see the whole story and I like that usually I just get about 20 minutes into a game and then it's like game over and then I'm like I don't care but I'm kind of invested in this story it's a story of a blue dude who has like a giant robot dinosaur outfit that he wears like this isn't just like a robot dinosaur there's a dude inside and I want to know I want to know his story I don't know if there are dudes and uh yeah, it's like a Dino Gundam sort of thing. I don't know if there are dudes like inside this uh, scorpion stegosaurus guy that just jumped in a hole like a dumbass, but... And it appears that there are some like... real dinosaurs. Why are you jumping away? I mean, that does look like a robot triceratops. I wonder if that has like two guys in it. And is that a child in that one? You got kids doing their fighting. That's... I understand. I hear that that game re requires a lot of uh, time investment, but I have appreciated you being here, and I do hope that uh, you drop by from time to time to, to say hello. Hopefully, nothing too cool will happen while you are away. But, uh, I guess there's always our VODs or whatever, and you can you won't see them live. But if we have any major breakthroughs or whatever, you know, you can always watch the, the archive version and see what a good time everybody who was here live had. You won't completely miss out. I'd hate for that to happen. But you know, you have your guilds and your loyalties and whatnot and I understand. Leroy Jenkins, am I right? It's been a popular game for a very long time. And I believe you told me that you can play for free up to level 20. I don't know how long it takes to level up in that game, but uh... I guess I... now that uh... Since South Park did their World of Warcraft episode, I actually wouldn't be the first cartoon 
to uh, play the game. And I like to be the first cartoon to do everything. But I guess I could put my own spin on it or something. My spin being that I haven't played it ever before. I'm not sure I've ever actually played a game that's considered a massive multi-orgy thing or whatever Imporg stands for. Oh yeah, massive multiplayer orgy group. Of multi player online orgy group. Oh, yeah, the P. That's right, I left out the P. Was this an RPG? Oh, yeah, that's right. Sometimes people just call them MMOs, but it's also an RPG. Such a noob in all regards. But hey, I think this this show will uh, maybe help me out with my casual noobness in life, hopefully. So flattered that that you uh, that you told me. I am a little sensitive, not too sensitive. Like I wouldn't be like you know sending you weird messages or anything. Like, but I would probably like secretly wonder like did I did I do something or say something to alienate Lucky Hidan? He doesn't watch the show anymore. Oh, I know. I know. I'm just... You know me always saying stuff. When you like, when you when you watch, it'll be like, "Whoa, there's Lucky!" You know, not that it isn't like an event now when you tune in or anything. It's super cool. But if you watch the show less, that would just be like, you know, it'll be like, "Holy crap, Lucky Hidon is here!" And uh. Oh, I would have like a whole monitor? That would be... Oh man. I would be honored.
kind of wish we had three monitors here for the show. We have a second monitor. You can't see it on the screen. It's like in, in front of me, behind the camera, so that I can see extra stuff. That's why sometimes I'm not looking at the computer screen, but I'm still responding to things. It's because I'm looking at the off-screen monitor. But I think a third monitor would be even better. the damn bombs. I guess it's time for me to be the this dude now.
Alright. Oh, that's bullshit. See, I thought it was cool that it gave you infinite continues before. But now it's getting, now it's getting hard, and I'm feeling like I'm obligated to beat the game because it's given me the opportunity to beat it. But now I'm getting annoyed. Alright, I'll give it one more shot. Like, I don't even know how many levels this game has. I just don't think so. I've had enough. I think I'm gonna go, uh, 
I'm gonna hang out in the talk show and IRL section and uh, it might not be super entertaining but maybe some people will pop in to see what just what the heck this is and uh so obviously even even robot dinosaurs doesn't get the uh the crowds popping in so I don't know so I'm gonna I'm gonna do this yep It's time for me to go I'll be back I will be back Thanks for watching Do not for Goodbye